What is going on? My name is Andrew and welcome to this video. Now this is not the video that I had originally planned to air today. However, I've been getting some uh, disturbing reports that uh, have been happening over the weekend and uh, uh, even you know, yesterday when I played I thought something suspicious was going on but earlier today a uh, subscriber of mine sent me some pictures and I want to share those pictures with you because uh, it is uh, pretty disturbing about what's happening in Black Ops 2. Um, apparently there's a new hack that's going around that is enabling uh, players to pretty much get everything in the game, um, rank up really fast, and um, have disproportionate number of kills uh, to their statistics as well as uh, you know being able to have an aimbot and um, being able to see people through walls and things um, one of the things that puzzled me was uh, you know people were shooting really accurately and they had horrible statistics um, you know people with you know 0.50 or less KDs and less than you know 150 score per minute you know these guys weren't good um, they're not reverse boosters either, um, and and they're just being uh, a little too uh, uh, accurate with the weapons, um, and it's, they're not improving at the game. I can assure you that. Um, so let's cut to those pictures uh, now, as I have to cut the audio. All right. So as you can see uh, here, this is the guy who. Um, uh, a subscriber of mine sent me his uh, combat uh, record and uh, his name is like Fuzz X Monster or something like that and uh, as you can see here he has 26,000 kills he has a 0 .73 KD and uh, 279 score per minute now uh, you know eh, that's about right for nine days played for a guy's you know, probably is not that good or doesn't get to play a lot or who's only a sniper but uh, let's look at his other statistics now first up on the screen is a picture that shows that he has 92,000 almost 93,000 uh, RPG kills wait a minute I thought this kid only had 26,000 total kills Right, could it be a bug, could it be a fluke. Let's move on. 100 killer kills. He's used it 46,000 times and he has 31,000 kills. Something's fishy now. Let's look at his uh, grenades. Over nearly 700 million times used, nearly 70,000 kills. Now that ratio seems about right, about 10% of grenade kills will kill most people in about the 10 to 25 percent range so the ratio is accurate but 68,000 kills I don't know about that one and then lastly let's look at this last picture which shows this guy's name up top again and then best deadliest weapons RPG 93,000 kills crossbow 18,000 kills and finally the ballistic knife with 13,000 kills. Now, this guy only has 26,000 kills. So, obviously, this guy's been hacking. So, let's get this guy reported. And, you know, Treyarch, you know, we got to get uh, got to get on top of this. All right, let's cut back to the, uh, to the game audio. And we'll talk about uh, the gameplay and some other stuff. All right. All right, so there you have it. That is the uh, video or pictures that was sent to me. Uh, by a subscriber uh, earlier today and I um, I did not push my uh, regularly scheduled uh, upload uh, and instead I decided to make uh, this video to um, you know get the word out that to Treyarch that you know a lot of people are hitting this game right now um, with hacks and, and mods and stuff of that nature um, as I said earlier, you know, I think that I've been in some lobbies where it's a little suspicious, these deaths, you know. The the MSMC and the PDW have taken a serious nerf uh, by Treyarch recently. And I'm seeing these guns in, in lobbies with virtually no recoil being killed by them. 
and uh, you know in order to, to shoot those guns accurately you know it's now taking um, a little more skill level to, to use down. those weapons and seeing uh, you know these kids use these weapons and be made looking like you're a noob when you know you're sitting there at a two plus KD and you're going how is this guy who has a .25 doing this to me um, it is very suspicious now obviously there could be luck involved there could also be some lag issues involved but I don't know it, it's getting very suspicious um, and I think Treyarch needs to look at it and see you know are people hacking in this game beyond what is uh, you know their quasi aimbot in, in, in the target finder but uh, you know, I, I personally, I've, I've gone on record saying that I hate the target finder because it simulates uh, an aimbot. And I hate the, you know, select fire because it simulates rapid fire. Um, but, you know, those things are in the game. But a lot of people are, you know, going online and getting these uh, these hacks. Um, I did a quick YouTube search for, for Call of Duty Black Ops 2 hacks. And there was a ton of videos of people showing... You know how to hack in this game so you know if you're uh, uh you know head of security over at Treyarch or Activision you know do a quick YouTube search and you should be able to find uh these recent videos that are popping up of guys who are pretty much boasting that they're not getting caught uh hacking the game so uh you know that needs to to, to get addressed and you know if Treyarch watches this, Activision watches this, and, and they do something about it to you know not only this kid but also to uh, to everybody else who's hacking in this game, I would greatly appreciate it. And um, you know if you encounter these hackers and you have uh, evidence, whether it's pictures or preferably video evidence, go ahead and you know send it to me, and uh, you know I'll be able to afford it to, to Treyarch and Activision uh, or even. Might even have to start a whole series based on exposing hackers, but uh, you know we'll see what happens uh, down the road. Hopefully, Treyarch gets on top of this because uh, it, what has happened in previous games, you know, COD 4 through uh, through Modern Warfare 2, you know, those three games they're all hacked. World at War, particularly. Oh my God, that game is so hacked. Combat training isn't hacked in that game. It's so bad. Um, uh, you know. This has this issue has to be addressed by uh, the developer because it is uh, potentially game breaking, um, you know, and for a franchise that is as popular and as widely played as Call of Duty, you know, this has to get uh, addressed. Now, uh, one of the reasons why I used this gameplay was because uh, I struggled in the beginning. You know, I'm a pretty good player, and uh, you know, sometimes you know. It could be lag or something that that gets the better of me, but uh, in this game, you know, I was struggling early on with my vector, and I got a little upset, and I switched to uh, this uh, uh, what is this, the AN94, which is one of my you know better assault rifles that I use, and as soon as I switched to it, you know, the game turned around. I didn't need a flip on a little switch on a hack to uh, do better at the game. I just need to. You know, we focus myself and we switch a weapon, switch a class, and you know that enables me to then, uh, you know, recenter myself and start to do better at the game. Um, and I think that that's why hacks are so bad. Uh, it, it 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 does you a greater disservice by hacking a game than it will ever do you a good thing. Yeah, you might be able to get a couple of kills. But you'll never be good at the game. You'll always be a bad player if you use hacks. And, you know, hacks are really why I left the, the PC gaming uh, scene. Because, you know, all those the PC shooters, particularly if they're free, majorly hacked. And, uh, you know, I, I stopped playing those games. But, you know, I love shooters. And it, it's such uh, a sad uh, thing to say that so many people like hacking. Uh, shooters and uh, instead of you know dedicating the time to get better um, getting better is is just all about using um, better tactics learning better aim learning better routes um, playing the game a lot yeah those things take time but there is no shortcut in life um, 
you know, if you want to be a doctor, you can't just, you know, take a little shortcut and, and you know, all of a sudden be a, the world's greatest neurosurgeon. Right? You're going to have to put in the time to go to medical school and to, uh, you know, learn how to be uh, a, a doctor or a surgeon. You can't just expect it to, to happen overnight. Um, you're going to have to put in some hours into these games to learn how to get better. And I, I guarantee you, if you put the time in to get better at these games, you will not only feel better about yourself, but you'll have more confidence in, in not only gaming, but it can even spur into other areas. Like, um, I used to play a lot of sports. Uh, you know, at one point, wasn't that good. Um, but what did I do? I put in hard work and got better. And, you know, that translates into other areas. It translates to your academics. You know, if you're not doing good at school, you know, what do you need to do? You need to put some time into your schoolwork and get better grades. So, you know, that's, that's pretty much a tangent. But um, I still have that serious idea about how to get better at, at uh, shooters. And so I'm probably going to push that, and, you know, um, soon so that people... Can, you know, if you're struggling at, at these games and you want to get better and you're tempted to go out and buy those hacks, I would tell you, you know, don't do it. Um, not only can you are you risking getting banned by uh, the game developers or a uh, system ban, you know, you're doing yourself a disservice. You will never be a good player if you hack, if you use aimbots or if you use, uh, you know, anything else in this game uh, that these people are coming out with that are um, you know essentially cheating so um, thanks for watching I hope uh, you know Trey can uh, can get a hold of this and, and start banning people because particularly that aimbot really and the bones seeing bones through walls that one's really pissing me off because I think some of these players are using this against me because they can't um, they can't tangle with me and some of my gaming buddies who are even better than I am and uh yeah so uh thanks for watching and if you have any videos or pictures exposing hackers be sure to send them over to me and be sure to send them to activision support and Treyarch and vonderhor and uh yeah so thanks for watching and as always see you next time